Hey guys, it's me Tom and I'll show you another water replay. This one's a bit... Oh, sorry. This one's a bit rushed, but we'll show you what this play did. <clears throat> yeah, so if you see it's corner town hall, best bet to queen walk it <coughs> or use suicide heroes, but since the town hall is not really right at the edge, then queen walk can be helpful as well. So this is what we'll do. The attacker will take out this level 5 Gig Inferno. Now this bit where you have to be patient or you screw it up. Notice the Queen's going left and then right, then left, then left again. And now she's going right. Well, most of you thinking will probably put the king on the 3 o'clock side right now, but watch further. Now, yeah, she goes on that hut, but where will she go after that? This bit surprised me. She went left, so... She goes on to the wizard tower. So... Yeah, being patient like that pay <coughs> helps. So that means after the wizard tower, she'll go on to that shell, she'll stay left. So, for some things, you just have to be patient. Like, if you put your king there and she went the other way, then, uh, yeah, the raid probably won't have ended that well. Even though the base kind of rushed a bit. Not the best place to jump since the queen will walk outside along and take this collector anyway, but uh, whatever. Might have one raged her there, but it's okay also. Jumps are good place. Scan shots down. These two infernals down here were single infernals, so possibility of the one of them locking onto champion early is a bad idea, so probably better for her to tank the scatter. This champ tank the scatter at the right and work their way through the back, back flanks of the defenses. Here now, with the hogs. Good hit, just a bit rushed. The base is quite rushed, so yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching guys, and peace out.